Hello friends, this is Yusuf here. In this video, we are going to see few display fill tricks which is uh, overlay and read and write concept. We usually do uh, EXFMT to display a screen of a file. So normally this EXFMT means it's a combined read and uh, write and read. Okay, so actually this REC002 is actually a record format. So we can individually read and write this record format also. Let's see this with an example. I'm going to create a display file f6 dspf01 dspf17 So I'm going to have a record REC001 It's going to be a record, simple plain record and I'm going to write this is first screen Okay, then I'm going to create a second record it's a record and I'm going to have this is second screen okay so now you have to record format with first screen and second screen so let's compile this it's compiled so we are going to create a program just to display these two record format as of now so we have six uh, pgm one RPG L. Okay, let me give you a small tip. So if you press Shift F3, okay, you can actually browse the other source member from the screen. So I'm going to take F4, and I can refer any uh, source. Okay. Um, so that will be displayed in the bottom. The good thing is actually you can copy the source, and then you can have it directly in your new file. Okay, maybe you can use this to copy the code from other programs. Okay, let me quickly read the codings. Okay, what I have done is I have declared the display file. Our display file is dspf001. Then instead of exfmd, I have given a write and then a read. Let's see what it does. So let me compile this. 14. It's compiled. So if you, I'm going to call this program pgm001. So as expected, now you see there is a write and then read happened so write is writing this particular data in the record and then read is actually reading it and displaying it in the screen so exfmt is actually a combined read and write so when you issue a re exfmt first it will write and then it will read the record ok now let's change the code a little bit ok I have just added the second record format also as a write and read let us compile this and run okay so it's showing the first screen if you press enter it's going the second screen okay now we are going to see what is overlay overlay is something like it's like uh, a screen which is appearing on top but still showing the data of the screen which is behind it for example now the second screen is overridden the first screen but if you use overlay both will be displayed let's see it in action i'm taking 17 in our display file and i'm going to set my second record is overlay so 8 overlay keyword s yes, and then overlay without erasing yes so now what we have done is we have set the overlay parameter for the second screen so if you display the second screen is having the overlay parameter so now we are going to change our program okay so we are writing the first record and then reading it it will display the first screen and then we are writing the second record and then we are reading it so let's see how this behaves now first let us compile the display file and then program now let's call so the first screen is displayed but if you give a enter the second screen is displayed but the content is still there okay now the another tricky point is or the requirement is I do not want the first screen to be displayed I want only the directly second screen to be displayed but with the content of both first screen and second screen so which means what I am trying to say here is I am going to write the data of the first record format but I am not going to read it so it's going to be no read and then I am writing the second record format and then I am reading the second or displaying the second record format let's see now so if you call this program right 
so directly both will be displayed because this is first writing the content of first record and then writing the content of second record since it has a, it has a overlay it is displaying both so this will be the concept of most of the uh, display files in which they will be having a constant uh, help on the bottom like f2 f3 exit f5 refresh those stuffs and they will put this as a overlay so every screen will be displaying this they will just write this record and then when they display the screen it will be displayed on top of it so hope this helps for you uh, see you in the next video thanks for watching